Well, good morning. I'm D. Nice to meet you. Brand new day. Brand new channel. Brand new adventure. Today we are frantically packing and cleaning and getting ready to go on this new adventure. And that cleaning includes everybody. Say hi to all the people and half the way we go. Oh, hi all the people. So we are going to pack up Larry and hit the road here in just a little over two hours. <sighs> There's just not enough time in the day, but we're gonna make time, we're gonna take time, and we're gonna take you with us. So get cleaned up, we'll roll them. All right, we are in the truck. Everybody except Cindy, she's running a last minute errand before we hit the road. Truck is loaded, we got as much as we could fit in the back. Um, I have to buy everything else on the way, but that's the way it goes. I've got a credit card, I got a full tank of gas. We are gonna see how far we can get today. It's Tucumcari, New Mexico. So that'll be the first stop. Dogs say hi, they're ready to roll too. So get in, let's go. Come on, we're just waiting on you now. We are still in Arizona. We are switching drivers because I gotta work. Work, 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 work. We had to track down dogs because they all jumped out when we got out. So we... You're not leaving me. We should have left them at the side of the road. Right. This will be my office for the next little while. Cindy's gonna be driving. Me and Jimmy. I wonder if I should be riding in the back. No legroom. Okay, to the that way. Off we go. Half the way we go. Half the way we go. In my opinion, when you get to New Mexico, the scenery improves immediately. It really did. It did. I'm it just got by that. much more interesting. So I'm not saying all of New Mexico is like that because it's not. But this part, at least. Yes, please. Take one of each. So we are headed out at Albuquerque. The roads into and through are not really that great. It's uh, kind of bumpy. So we are not going to be sad to get back out of Albuquerque. Say Albuquerque again. We made it to Tucumcari, New Mexico. And you might not know this, but Tucumcari is far better than Albuquerque. It's a fact, look it up. Six hours on the road. Um, Albuquerque is just everything you would think it would be, except the roads are a lot rougher. But we're happy to be here. We're staying at this fine Best Western in Tucumcari with our fancy Fancy, fancy setup. So we will get some shut-eye tonight and we will hit the road early. And tomorrow night we will be sleeping in our new travel trailer. Sweet, sweet. Hey, have a good night. Go to bed. Good morning. We spent uh, last night in beautiful Temecula. Nope. Wouldn't that be fun, Temecula, California. But now we were in Tucumcari, New Mexico which in certain circles is known for its uh, pet-friendly Best Western. And its fantastic view of the freeway. Can't complain. They let me keep the dogs this morning. We will load everything back in Larry and go find Matt. Should be a fun-filled day. We are gonna stop at Camping World and 
check it out. Get some stuff that uh, we think we're going to need, that we know we're going to need, and do a lot of, uh, a lot of looking at hot Texas. Buckle up, buttercup. I do want to give a shout out to the Best Western here in Tucumcari. The staff was friendly, beds were fairly comfortable, room was clean, water was hot, and a hot breakfast comes with it. I'm talking oatmeal, sausage, eggs, biscuits, gravy, and the whole show. So good job, guys. Guys, I think Larry might be a vampire. Because look how he sparkles in the sun. All right, get in the truck. Amarillo, so many RVs, but we're not RV shopping. We are just shopping, shopping to see what we can find. Body break for everybody. Everybody's adoring the dogs, as everybody does. So let's go see if there's anything interesting. I've only been in a couple of camping worlds, but the ones I've been in did not actually have campers or RVs in there, so that's kind of fun. It's a big store. I was just in New Mesa one a couple of days ago and the head was not this big. So we're looking for dishes for the dogs because we did not bring theirs and they were spoiled and need to have their own special dishes. We are somewhere in a neighborhood in Dallas, or the outskirts of Dallas, because there's a wreck on the freeway and Google said, take this crowd to the neighborhood. And so we listen to Google and wonder, is everybody else doing the same thing? What do you think? Yeah, they're all in front of us. They're all in front of us. So we will look at the pretty houses and it's green here, but it's 97 degrees. Phoenix, send somebody to Dallas to find out what they're doing, that it can still be hot, but there's trees and grass. It rains here, I think. It rains, they just They get rain. That and there's... They just never get rain. It's not just sand. There's actual soil here, I'm guessing. You could probably dig a basement here. Let's get out and try it. Good morning and welcome to the weekend. Fourth of July weekend. I am in Texas and it's hot. It's very hot. What, this? What's this? Oh, this behind me? Let me take a minute and introduce you to Madge. So you probably all know Larry. And we got Larry for one because, well, we needed a truck because we got tired of renting a U-Haul trailer every time that we went to Lowe's to pick something up. And you know how, many, how much stuff we picked up. Um, if you're following Cozy Mountain Cottage, this is Madge, 2021 Imagine. 
XLS 22RBE. Single slide on this side. She's pretty.